What is God nudge? It's one of that things that just won't go out of your mind. It just keeps going over and over again and you think it's something you need to do. Maybe it's that still small voice speaking to you. I think that's the Holy Spirit trying to get us our attention. Or maybe it's just a, a gentle prompting that, you know, call her. You need to do this. But I believe as we listen to the, for God to speak, he says his sheep hear his voice, that we will start to recognize God nudges. And when we do, it's the Holy Spirit trying to interact with us, God trying to interact with us. This is Joyce, the Practical Christian Woman, and this has been one of the most exciting things I've been learning lately, is how to act and react to God nudges. First off, though, you need to know if they are real. That's your main clue, if it's real or not from God. So first off, does it contradict the Bible? Do you know that? If not, check it out or ask somebody, is this something that would be contradictory to the Bible? Secondly, if you think it's something that would bring evil into your life or harm into your life, then don't do it. Find out more information, but don't do it. God's not leading you in the direction of bad things. And then next, third thing is, see, do the doors open for that? Is it, is it easy or you feel like you have to punch through the wall to get there? That's what you're looking for. And then does this give you confidence? Do you feel like maybe sometimes you're scared, but you think, I can go do this. I know I can with God's help. And then, for, and then if you're still confused, ask somebody. Ask somebody you trust that you know is a godly person. Is this really from God? But oftentimes you'll find out by starting to try it as long as you know it doesn't contradict the Bible.